Hello everyone and welcome back to Brooke's Beauty Bazaar. My name is Brooke and in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing some fungal acne safe moisturizers with you guys. Roll the footage. So moisturizer is hands down the product that everyone with fungal acne seems to struggle with the most. And that's no surprise because fungal acne safe moisturizers are definitely few and far between. I can't even tell you guys that I'm overly thrilled with the options that we have for fungal acne, but I do think that something is better than nothing, obviously. And the real thing here that I want to drive home with you guys all the time, I'm always preaching this message, but moisturizer is absolutely essential if you are hoping to improve your skin's texture and quality, no matter what type of acne or any condition you suffer from. So in this video, I'm gonna be walking you guys through seven different moisturizers that are fungal acne safe. Only one of them is gonna be glycerin free, so stay tuned for that. Let's do this. The first product I wanna mention for you guys is the Garnier Moisture Rescue Refreshing Gel Cream. Now this product is by and large the most affordable and accessible of all the moisturizers I'm gonna to mention today. And it comes in two different variations. So the original one is the green tub and then the pink tub is the rose water scented one. I actually have a brand new tub of the rose water version here. I just picked it up at my Walmart for $5 and some change, probably about six bucks in total. It truly is gonna be your best value because you get 1.7 fluid ounces for $6. This stuff is really lightweight. It's really easy to use day and night, whatever you wanna do with it. I think personally, my only drawback on this product is that it seems to leave a little bit of a film over my skin. And if you've used it and experienced the same thing, let me know in the comments below because I'm just wondering if that happens to everyone or not. This product is actually infused with vitamin C and a fruit water blend, which is antioxidant rich, meaning that you're getting a little extra bang for your buck when you're paying for this moisturizer, and we love something like that. So if you guys are looking for something that's just really simple, straightforward, and has a little bit extra at an affordable price, this would be my number one pick. The second product I wanted to mention to you guys is the Bioderma Hydrobio Gel Cream. My twin sister calls this Hydrabio, which I think is hilarious. And I actually have to tell you, um, I mentioned her because she is the one who first used this product. I actually have only used it like two times when I've stolen some from her tube. So she personally did not love this product because she felt like it was too fragranced, heavily fragranced, and that just took away from the experience. And then on top of it, she felt like it just wasn't as potent and moisturizing and kind of creamy and rich as she wanted it to be. But now looking back, because it's been a while since she's used it, she thinks that if she had used it in conjunction with a solid moisturizing routine, so adding your hyaluronic acid and water, and then seal everything together with it, it probably would have worked a lot better for her. So the other main downside to this product and the reason she never repurchased it was because it's gonna run you about $25 for 1.3 fluid ounces. So that is just not a lot of product for your money. However, if you guys are into Bioderma, I really like them as a brand. I do think it's a good solid product and it might work for some of you out there. Third product I wanted to mention to you guys is the Hada Labo Skin Plumping Gel Cream. Now this is another super expensive product. You're gonna be paying about $23 for 1.76 fluid ounces. However, this product gets rave reviews and it is infused with hyaluronic acid, which you know I love, and also collagen, so it's got those good extras in it as well. It's gonna really make your skin look nice and plump on the surface. So if you guys have used this product, I want you guys to tell me your opinion on it in the comments below right now because I will be honest with you guys, this one is high up on my personal wish list. All right, so before I get on to the rest of the products, I did just wanna quickly remind you guys that I have created free fungal acne shopping guides for all your beauty and skincare needs for Target, Walmart, Ulta, and Sephora. These shopping guides are completely free and all you need to do to get them is look for the shopping cart emojis and click the link in between them in the bar below. Mm -hmm. 
So the fourth product that I want to mention to you guys is the La Roche-Posay Toleron Sensitive Fluid. Now you're going to get 1.4 fluid ounces of this for $30, so it's easily up there as one of the most expensive on this list. However, this product gets rave reviews. It's completely safe for fungal acne, and it has the simplest formulation of any of the products that I'm going to mention today. And I am a firm believer that the simpler the ingredient list, the more effective and amazing the product's going to be, just because every Every ingredient is going to be like working and pulling its weight equally it feels like and actually doing something that's effective so I think that's kind of why I really love it and I also really trust La Roche-Posay because I think they really are good with their science and they know what they're talking about and they make lots of really beautiful products So products number five and six are by the same brand, and if you watch my channel, these two products will probably come as no surprise to you. So number five, I have been using long-term as my moisturizer, and I have not had any problems with it, and then number six is a version of it too. So the first one is the CeraVe Moisturizing Cream, which I love because it is just your all-in-one moisturizing product. It's your body lotion, and it can be your face moisturizer as well. It's around $18 for a tub of this stuff, and and I will say, while that's not necessarily cheap, you get a lot of product for your money. And I personally do shop at Costco and have a membership there, and you can get a really good deal on this. I don't know the exact deal, but I'll try to link it below if I can for you guys. Um, this particular tub, and it came with a smaller tub too, is 19 ounces. So in the long run, that's actually a dollar per ounce, so that's some really good money there. It's literally less from that for Costco. And then the next product, so product number six, is the AM Facial Moisturizing Lotion with SPF 30. Now, this product is a moisturizer and a sunscreen of 30 at the same time. So it's a great two-in-one value for you. And if you haven't found a sunscreen that works for you yet, then this could really be where it's at. But both of these products do contain an ingredient called cetyryl alcohol, which is technically a fatty alcohol. And depending on if you put it into like folliculitis scout or Sazia or one of those, it's gonna throw it up as an error. Basically, in researching this, I haven't found that there's sufficient enough evidence to say that it definitely causes the growth of Malassezia yeast. However, some of you who are extremely sensitive may not wanna go down this route because it could cause you problems. Just know that straight up, but I've been using it safely with no issues for a long time now. So product number seven, the final one that I wanted to mention to you guys, and I have also mentioned this one before, but it is the Fab Beauty Coconut Cream Water. Now, First Aid Beauty is a brand that I used to really love their products and use before I discovered I had fungal acne, and at that time, their products actually worked really well for me, and I felt like all of them were effective. So to be honest with you guys, because of my solid history of using their products, I would totally trust them. This is also the only moisturizer on this list that is glycerin free if you're looking for that and I am going to link my glycerin free product video right now for you guys in case you wanted to check that out because there's lots of good little mentions within it the biggest downsize easy of this product is that it is $34 for 1.7 fluid ounces and I just feel like that is actually the only reason why I don't go and pick this product up more frequently. I feel like I would get through it way too fast and I just don't like the idea of having to spend 30 plus dollars for a moisturizer when I could spend $7 on one or $18 for a large tub of it. Um, I am kind of into the frugalness right now just with everything going on in our world and I really like to provide a broad price range for you guys because I feel like you know everyone needs to find something that works for them no matter what their budget is and hopefully this video accomplished that. So that was seven fungal acne safe moisturizers for you. As always I'm going to link all of these products in the bar below and you can also shop them through brooksbeautybazaar.com. If you guys have used any of these products make sure to let me know what you guys think of them in the comment section below because I'd love to hear your opinion especially about the ones that are on my wish list. And if you guys look to the left of your screen right now, I have two videos that you guys should definitely check out. The first one is Everything Fungal Acne Safe from the Sephora Collection, and the second one is Everything Fungal Acne Safe from the Ulta Beauty Collection. Don't forget to come say hi on Instagram at Brooks Beauty Bazaar, where I hang out every single day.